All right. John, we're headed to one of my favorite places in Israel. Mazor is an idyllic spot. We're going to see Dronework Bioag, a company that we've met before and fallen in love with. It's hard not to. So we'll, we'll get the details from Dan, but these guys basically set out to address the problem of how do we feed the world's growing population in the coming decades? And I feel like we're just scratching the surface of Israeli ag tech companies. We need, as humanity, we need to produce as much food in the next 40 years as we did in the last 8,000 years. And that's what we have. Mycorrhizae have been around for 400 million years. This is how plants grow in nature. But in agriculture, first we kill everything and then we try to grow plants. And there's a need to restore that life in the, in the uh, ecosystem. The problem was that even though it's been researched for about 100 years now, no one really knows how to produce mycorrhizal inoculants cost-effectively. We've, we've cracked the code on how to produce this stuff very cost-effectively. So you're getting higher crop yields, you're doing it with less fertilizer, you have better resistance to stress, and you're sequestering carbon at the same time. So we're, we're likely the largest mycorrhizal inoculant producers in the world today. We uh, will have covered four and a half million acres by the end of this year. And the yield increases across those four and a half million acres are roughly enough to feed the people of Uruguay for an entire year. Our estimate across those four and a half million acres is that we've sequestered about nine megatons of CO2 equivalent in soils, which is a huge number. You're living the dream. I, I'm happy, I'm not complaining. <laughs> right. I, I think if you're an entrepreneur and you don't like your job, then you've done something really wrong because <laughs> you, you made your job. <laughs>